what's better than a movie night? Watching a movie on your own outdoor theatre. What's up guys, Ben Jammin here, back with another Nomad Tech Review. This one is sponsored by Nebula. They're an anchor company, and you've probably heard of anchor. Today we're talking about this portable projector. Ooh, I know what you're thinking guys, but not this time. This is not one of those portable projectors we've seen before. No, no, no. This is the Nebula Cosmos Laser 4K. How good is this? <laughs> this is an experience. <laughs> Honestly. It's one of the coolest things I've done like, in a while. That's amazing with streaming. Yeah, right? the quality of it as well. Woo! The speaker's pretty good. You might think you don't need a projector in your life until you see what this one can do. Let's take a look. First up, I thought we should address the idea that projectors are rubbish. Because it's true, they are. A lot of them anyway, but not this one. The Nebula Cosmos 4K projector uses lasers, three of them actually, which means less light is wasted and more of it makes it onto the screen which makes for an incredibly bright image. Much brighter, like 2,400 ISO lumens of brightness actually. That's so bright that you can actually use this projector in the daytime and it has a sensor that if anybody walks in front of it, it automatically reduces the brightness, which is handy. The image quality is just insane. I don't know if you, you won't be able to see that because it's all blurred, but let me just see if I can focus on it. That it just won't come out on camera and do it justice. But. I can't actually believe that there is a cinema on the side of my van, a 4K laser projector on the side of the van. I knew it was going to be good, but I'm blown away. This is absolutely awesome. <laughs> we just measured that. It's actually 95 inches across the width of my awning. It goes up to 150 inches. So if we had a bigger screen um, and we moved this further back, we could project it even larger, like on the side of a building or something. That's absolutely Awesome, can't wait to do that. <laughs> so much potential for fun. So let's talk about portability because that's the main thing that I'm personally interested in. Well, Nebula designed the Cosmos Laser 4K to be the brightest movable projector, but is it actually portable? Well, yes, kind of. It's a compact design, it has a nice ergonomic handle and it has inbuilt speakers for a total of 30 watts of Dolby audio. I say it's kind of portable because it's clearly not something you're gonna be hiking with. It's more luggable than portable, but it's actually brilliant if you wanna take it into say your garden and watch a movie in your garden with your friends or take it on a camping trip or I don't know, go and host a secret cinema in an abandoned hotel, if that's what you're into. Bonafide haunted house. A haunted house hotel. And we're going to set up a cinema inside. <laughs> Got this old conservatory, which definitely needs clearing up. But I think we could be showing a movie in here tonight. Pretty exciting. There's no power in here, but I also have a solution for that. Pretty sweet location, but currently not being used. So great opportunity to invite a couple of friends around, get together and watch a movie. With a 4K laser projector. Boom, always wanted a projector. Probably worth noting on the portability aspect is that it doesn't have a built-in battery, so you need to bring your own power supply. I used my Anker 757 powerhouse uh, portable solar generator which was actually perfect had loads of power i could have been to watch movies all night long if i really wanted to guaranteed to last 6.3 times longer than your popcorn anybody forget popcorn? as far as usability the picture quality has absolutely blown me away i kid you not i was absolutely astounded unfortunately it just doesn't do it justice on the camera you have to see this with your actual eyes i tried to get it so it wasn't flickering sometimes it looks like it's flickering on the camera uh, that's to do with the settings of the camera and not matching the frequency of the laser in the projector but you don't see any of that in your eye you just see a perfect crystal clear 4k image it's amazing and it's not just me saying that a bunch of people that i've shown the projector to and that were at the cinema night that i hosted also came up to me and said wow that was actually much better quality than i was expecting the fact it's got inbuilt speakers is really sweet and it's really impressive actually it kicks out a decent sound but it's particularly good when you pair it with a bluetooth speaker like this soundcore motion boom plus 
Um, I used this when I was hosting it, the cinema night in the hotel because it was a much bigger room and this was more than adequate. It's a, yeah, really good sound. The thing I like about this sound called Motion Boom Plus, other than the fact that it has 80 watts of incredibly loud sound, is that it's waterproof and it floats. Hopefully. It does float! Thank wow. God for that. Definitely didn't think I'd be throwing a Bluetooth speaker into the sea today. I guess I'm gonna have to go and get that, aren't I? That's high. Okay, enough larking around, back to the projector. When you first boot it up, it asks you to connect the 4K streaming dongle, which is that little thing in the back. Uh, I think that might be like the brain, and potentially that means it could be upgradable in the future. I don't know. The controller has quick buttons for all your favorite streaming services, YouTube, Netflix, Prime Video, Disney Plus, and the whole projector runs Android TV. So if you're not watching content via the HDMI cable on the back or via the USB, you can download over 7,000 apps from the Google Play Store or stream any of your favorite services because this projector is also a smart TV. And not one of those smart TVs that doesn't work and is really clunky and fiddly and annoying to use. It's actually a dream to use. Every single time I've connected it and set it up in different locations, it is a breeze. First time it asks you to update the firmware, which you should do. But apart from that, trouble free, super easy, portable cinema in my combi. Oh. Just realized whilst doing this movie night that we can actually project it onto the screen from behind and sit here in the combi and watch a TV out there on the edge of our awning. Like at the moment that's all back to front, but you, there is a setting that you can flip that and do a rear projection, I think. So definitely have to try that out. That's gonna be so sick. Here's my van and there's my cinema. I'm honestly so stoked about this, it's brilliant. Don't watch a lot of TV, prefer to watch the stars personally myself, but if I am gonna watch a movie, and I do watch movies sometimes, I do watch content, why not project it on the side of your van, on the side of your awning, on the side of a flipping building? All of that's possible. Honestly, gonna have so much fun with this. I've been waiting ages for a projector system that's portable, but actually powerful enough to give you a real theater experience. And finally, it's here. It's gonna be absolutely incredible for watching sporting events like the World Cup coming up or watching movies in memorable locations. I can't wait to take this on a road trip. If you guys wanna get hold of a Nebula 4K laser projector, or if you want the slightly cheaper 1080 HD version or the Soundcore Motion Boom Plus, I will leave a link in the video description below. Thanks so much for hanging out with me, amigos. I'm gonna go watch a movie now. So until next time, happy travels. Hey, hey, that was so good! <laughs> that couldn't have happened at a perfect, perfect time.